Hi everyone, this is Ajamu Jimmy and welcome back to Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Hope you're having a wonderful day today because we are here in the depths still. I think we're going to be here for a while, but you know, actually maybe I'll finish out this quarter of the map and then... There we go. Just wanted to start the countdown for that. Um, ooh, ooh, I like this sword, man. It's so pretty. Ooh. Okay, but anyways, I should, uh, you know, digress, get back to what we're doing. Which is no clue what it is that we're doing, but we're gonna do it. You can be sure about that. Let's use this Lysol Reaper. Oh yeah, we're we're uh, you know continuing to explore the depths and chart out the places we haven't been, and we we think we hit a wall. So I think I found the way around that wall, and uh, you know away. We basically have to go back up to the surface and enter through uh, a different way. Okay. And I realize, why am I doing this? I've got the perfect being right here. Oh. This one definitely is interesting. I can't, I can't do this without, without my fan. I wonder if there's like a boss at the end of this. There's got to be something because this is, this is like, this is just one big path. I'm running low on bows, I know this. Oh no, not, not just bows, but arrows. Okay, that was a big, big cop-out. There's nothing here. That's interesting. Not sure why they made a big deal about it then. But yeah, that's it. Very nice, let's get to see. Maybe let's watch the whole cutscene. It's been a while since I've watch these I think I do still appreciate that the depths are so dark and the darkness is a big problem you have to figure out how to overcome granted we know how to overcome it but still I, I appreciate it I like it it's a cool feature cool mechanic I heard rumors that the switch 2 is gonna come out maybe next year um, but that's just uh, that's just perfect for me because I bought the switch like literally when this game came out, I bought the Switch. So, uh, but I do have a tendency to buy games, kind of, or buy consoles at the end of their life cycle. Just not intentionally. That's just how it goes. When I, uh, well, I guess first of all, when I got my original Xbox, my dad had bought it because his buddy from work actually bought the Xbox 360 when it came out, and, and just like sold him everything for like a hundred bucks. So that's kind of why I got that and then when I got the 360 it was more so that we couldn't really afford it until basically <laughs> when was it I think 2012 is when we bought the Xbox 360 and then the summer that year the or was it I think it was 2011 or 2012 but uh, basically whenever the Xbox one was announced is when I got the Xbox 360 and then with the Series X, or, or I guess with, with the Xbox One, I just skipped that. I didn't like that generation. I didn't think it was really that great. Um, actually, I don't need to be here at all. There's Oh no, there's one thing there. I check that out. But yeah, I skipped that. I skipped the Series, or the Xbox One, and same thing with the Series X and Series S. Um, at that point, by the time the Series, Xbox Series came out, I, uh, I had already gotten a gaming PC, and so I figured, you know, it's stronger than the Xbox, so, or it's more stable as well. I don't know if I'd say it's necessarily stronger, but it's more versatile, you know. I use it for gaming as well as work stuff. As a programmer, I code, I you know, use it for YouTube, use it for whatever I need, really. 
with the Xbox consoles, they're fun. And consoles in general, they're fun, but they're only good for one thing, right? So, But that was the big allure for me uh, when, when I was growing up. Just the fact that they were so much better than regular computers at games. Um, but of course, they couldn't do anything else. But that's a trade-off that I was willing to make when I was younger because I just wanted to play games, you know? Now I have multiple needs. Oh no. Okay, but I think we've covered everything here. This was just like a waste of time, really. I don't know why they made me do this. Let's see, is there any holes down here? It might make sense for us to... Go here. Yeah, I think it'll make sense for us to do that. I think the, the Game Boy Advance is one that I got relatively new. So that was one exception. That was a lot of fun. I don't even remember what year that was, but I think that might have been my best Christmas present. I was like so excited. There's a lot of good memories. Let's uh, get another fan. We are a fan of the fan. I think that's it. No, no, it's not. No, that is it. Yeah. break on Zelda's head question mark I don't know who this is it's gotta be Zelda it's just gotta be you know there's definitely a lot going on here though why did this get brighter Let's see, buddy. What do, what do you gotta say? Zona have devices here as well. Ah! Hmm? yeah You surprised me. Don't do that. I thought you might have been from the Yiga clan for a second. Hurry up and get your research clothes on, huh? You don't have research clothes? Wait, are you in the Yiga clan? Sure am. How dare you claim to be part of our clan? Absurd. For Master Koga, you're dead in one hit, buddy. Got bad news for you. Oh, he's fast! Oh, most impressive, buddy. That was two hits. Took two hits. Do I have any weapons I can get rid of? I think not, right? Not for the Eightfold Blade, at least. Alright, and we got this. Which does something for us. That's nice. Okay. But there's this area that I don't know if we've been to. And to be honest, it looks really interesting. Yeah, this... This, we, we gotta check this out. And then I also want to go here. Because we haven't been here. Right? I think that's true. I honestly have no idea. But... Let's do that. And then, of course, we got to check out the mine. So let's do, do those things in that order.
Come on, man. Not cool, little guy. Not cool at all. Why would they attack little old me? I'm just doing my thing. Living my best life. Yeah, Ganon is gonna be a joke at this point, I think. That's my prediction, at least. Although I know my sister, uh, my younger sister, had said that she found him and um, she couldn't beat him for some reason, but. She's also not known as a gamer in our family, so she struggles a lot. So it could just be that you know she doesn't know how to beat him. Not that he's difficult to beat. Which I'm inclined to think that's the case. I can't imagine it being a very difficult fight. I think she said she's done all the main stuff. Oh look, a dragon. How nice. Where are we going again? We're a little off track. I don't know where my dad is. I think my dad has actually stopped playing. That happens with him a lot. He, he just like loses interest in games. Especially if he's... If he doesn't see me playing the game, he'll eventually lose interest in it and stop on his own. And with this game, I haven't been playing, like, in our living room. I just play in my room. But it did hold his attention for quite a while. Uh, exploring the depths. He covered out the whole map. I was surprised that he did that. See, how do we get up here now? Um. Oh, that's a. Uh, I know what that is. What's that light? In your head, buddy. Never mind. Wow, that's embarrassing for me. Okay, let's see what this is. Oops. Ooh. Safety zone, or safety first. Transportation constructed from Dozonai devices is convenient, but precautions must be followed. Familiarizing yourself with the following guidelines will reduce the two most common causes of fatalities. One, keep your balance to avoid overturning the vehicle. If the vehicle is off balance, evacuate immediately. Protect, number two, protect the driver from all attacks. Even a simple error can threaten their ability to steer. Glory to Master Kogo. Wow, that was useless, guys. Absolutely useless. Oh, it looks like I can do some cooking here, though. Maybe I will cook. Okay, and I will start by cooking all of these. Because these are the best meals ever. Oh, that does three as well? I didn't know it was like that.
Hardy radishes, eh? That, that's where it's at. Oh, you know why? Because you can only find the hardy radish in the sky. What's this? No, we don't need that. We don't need that. Uh, we do need these. Let's just do five and see what it does. Fifteen, that's good. It's good enough for me, honestly. If I want to get myself into some gloomy trouble, it seems to happen quite a bit these days. And... Honestly, let's just... Let's just see what this does. I mean, we, we don't care about this stuff, really. We're just, like, winning at life right now. Or at least Link is. I don't know, I don't know if I'd say I am, but, you know. It's alright. Uh, okay, that's good enough for now. I would like more stamina food, but I think I just don't have the stuff for it. Love me some mighty bananas. Okay, but where where are the goods? That's what I want to know. They're up there. What a big flex. I could just climb this whole mountain. Give me your goodies. Okay, that's four battery pieces. Monocycle. Okay. Very nice. All right, now that we're here, we wanted to go here, right? Yeah, there's there's got to be something there. Well, at least I think so. I mean, worst case, there's a place that we could uh, dig, dig for stuff, or get zonite. Falora Canyon Mine. Oh look, a chest. No goodies. Oh, interesting. So it seems like we ran out of special loot. Now we're just getting the basic stuff. Not as much to get as I was hoping, actually. It's kind of sucky, if, uh, if I'm being honest. Alright, that's alright. It's okay, it's all good. It's all good in the hood. Um, from here I wanna, I just wanna see what's there. So we'll go there as well. Oh, really? Nothing? There we 
go. Okay. Nice. Okay. It's a little bumpy road up ahead, eh? That's all right, though. Oh, I can take it. Oh, this is back. Oh, this is back here, man. That's all right. Okay, well, there's not nothing here for sure. But there might not be something either. So, take from that what you will. But it's looking like a whole lot of nothing, in my humble opinion. In my humbled opinion. So, we're gonna scratch that out. And we're gonna keep pressing onwards. I see dudes to fight, but I just don't feel like ruining their day at the beach, you know? I mean, look at this guy. He's having so much fun. These guys are just dancing. These guys are just vibing, chilling. Look, he, this guy's just like literally chewing the air. Is that what they call it? No, chewing the fat. Oh, man, that's a different thing. All right. Anyways, yeah, I'll let them enjoy their time in the sun, uh, in their sun, uh, you know, to each their own. Maybe this is a sunny day for them. Oh no. What have I done? Come on, you can stand. Good enough. Okay, nice. Okay. Let's see now. Where do we think we are? Oh, there. But where specifically? It just might be above, honestly. Well, wow, okay, the cr the squad is like getting in my way a little bit there I got a feeling it's above oh wait no never mind I'm tripping I'm tripping hard <laughs> I forgot what I was looking for my bad. For some reason, I thought I was looking for one of those, uh, the light roots, but not today. Why is it so dark in here? It's not supposed to be this dark. I, th 
think that's the path. Yeah. Okay, and what have we here? We have a whole lot of nothing. So why is this a thing? Let's see, I'm holding out hope. There might be something up here. But I am impatient. Alright, nice. Yeah, there's a whole lot of nothing up here. Okay. Well, I'm so glad I did that. So underwhelming. Okay, well, we can go here. And I'm thinking we can make it to the last light route in this area. And then, so maybe, hmm. I don't know which. I'm thinking I'll take on one of the main story missions after this. But I just not I'm not sure which one to do. I think it makes sense to do the Gerudo one because I've covered the Gerudo underground. You know what I mean? I'm not gonna go down, I'm gonna go around. I think that's better. my best friend hey best friend hey don't run away from me Make this are we we need climbing clothes where's my climbers clothes don't i have at least one piece we can make it if we believe if we really believe all together we can make it There we go. No, don't run away from me. This won't do, man. This won't do. You know what? Actually, I forgot. Uh, I'm supposed to wear my funky helmet. Where's my funky helmet? There it is. And I'm supposed to drop one of these bad boys. Ooh. You guys see that? Buddy over there. Did I? It's gotta be from. It's gotta be here, right? No. I have no idea why he's there. I guess we'll find out either way.
That's so odd though, isn't it? Like, it's so random. that last one oh my gosh I can't even see him now. ah there we go <laughs> wish I could see you real buddy but I cannot great and all, but I don't know what you're doing or where you are. Oh, I don't want to break this. I'm like literally shooting into the dark. Okay, it's not working. Oh. I think we're gonna kill him right here. I like that music though, man. It gets me every time. There we go. Get wrecked. Get wrecked rolled. Get Rick wrecked. <laughs> Do I have any weapons? Um, I'll attach it to this just so I can save it. <laughs> but give me that, give me that good stuff. Yep. Nice. Okay, and then we still have to go this way. I saw it when I was fighting that dude. So, we'll get it next time. But anyways, thanks everyone for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next part. Bye.